Good evening, everybody. Mike here, Flying V Cards and Breaks. Hope everyone is having a great day and a good start to your week. Uh, we are doing a five box mixer break tonight. And <clears throat> excuse me, my apologies for uh, this taking a little bit longer to break. Uh, this has been sold out now, I think, for four or five days. But uh, I have been uh, quite sick and uh, I have not been able to. Uh, but not be able to go live. Uh, and even tonight, uh, still not feeling that great, but uh, I don't want to keep you guys waiting any longer. So we are going to break tonight and hopefully pull some fire for you. Uh, I will make note, uh, there will be no personals tonight. I won't be offering that. Um, I will save that until I'm I'm kind of feeling much better again, but we will get uh, this break done tonight for you guys. And um, yeah, hopefully uh, we'll see some nice hits, all right? So if I'm not my chipper self, uh, I, I do apologize. Uh, going to see how much we can muster into this one energy for you guys, all right? Okay. Hey, Doug, how are you? Sean, welcome, Sean. All right, so let's read out the team list for this break tonight, and then we will get ripping, all right? So we got the following lineup. We have the Arizona Coyotes. And the Vegas Golden Knights for Dustin. Jesse has the Oilers. Troy has the Canucks. Jesse's got the Blackhawks. Doug has the Hurricanes. Islanders for Sweeter. Jesse has the Abs. LA for Sweeter. Lloyd, the Flames. Uh, Sean has the Caps. Jerome has the Flyers. Leafs for Sean. Matt has the Bruins. Penguins, Tomas. And thanks for joining, Sean. First time breaker with us tonight. Good luck, buddy. Uh, Rangers for Rob. Matt has the Ducks. Nice having me in a break again. Matt, Rob, the Canadians. Sharks for Jerome. Chris has the Stars. Florida for Mason. Doug, the Sabres. Jets uh, for Damien. Nice having me back in a break. Damien, Benny, the Wild. Blue Jackets for Stephen. Uh, nice having you back as well. Stephen, John has the Preds. Ottawa for Jesse. Jerome, the Red Wings. Devils for Kurt. Uh, Blues for Matt. And Jerome, the Tampa Bay Lightning. All right. Hey, Troy, how are you, sir? Okay, so let's get started. We will start things off tonight with 2017 Upper Deck Team Canada Juniors. Yeah, thanks, man. All right. Actually, no, Florida is probably not the uh, worst team to have, to be honest with you. Florida is not the worst team to have. In Series 1, you got uh, Spencer Knight to be chasing. All right, serial number uh, 41662. 41662. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm still struggling, buddy. This has been a this has been a rough ride here. All right. All good, man. I I appreciate all of you, and I don't like keeping anybody waiting. So, trust me, I I would have done this sooner if I would have been able to. Anyone who knows is broken with me. Uh, it takes a lot for me not to uh, not to break. So, okay, let's get started here. So, for those unfamiliar, the way we run Team Canada or any of the products that do not have team specific cards, they go to the team the player is currently with. Okay, the team. The player is currently with. If they are a retired legend, for example, uh, Wayne Gretzky would go to the Edmonton Oilers. Okay, it goes to the team that they played the majority of their career with. So that's how we will run this. Okay, good luck, everybody. And our first hit is going to be a Marty Brodeur exclusives. Nice pull. 
For the New Jersey, that will go to the New Jersey Devils. Martin Brodeur, 168 out of 199. One second here, just gonna just there we go. So a nice one there for the New Jersey Devils exclusives, Marty Brodeur. Hey, I'm a Canucks fan, man. So I, I'm not really watching the, the Leafs, to be honest with you. And what do we got next? We have Jarrett Anderson Dolan. Jarrett Anderson Dolan, local legends. I believe that is the LA Kings, Jarrett Anderson Dolan. I believe that's LA. I will double check on any guys that I'm unfamiliar with. Where they're 100% at currently. Well, there's another Jarrett Anderson Dolan exclusives. Jarrett Anderson Dolan, number 158 out of 199. Jarrett Anderson Dolan. Jarrett Anderson Dolan. Yeah, I could see you're going to appreciate that one, Adrian. And what do we got here? We have our first patch auto, Stelio Matios. Stelio Matios. Uh, patch auto. And this is number 70 out of 199. I'll have to see if I can tune in afterwards if it's still on. Stelio Matios. Uh, let me see where this guy's at. I've actually never heard of him before. Stelio Matios. He is Carolina Hurricanes. All right, this will go to the Carolina Hurricanes. He is a three round draft pick in 2017. 2017 draft pick. Stelio Matios. Next up, Jared McIsaac, program of excellence. Jared McIsaac. Jared McIsaac is, I believe, is it Detroit? Yes, that would be Detroit. That will go to Detroit. Jared McIsaac. Yeah, that's a nice one for you, Doug. Next up, Pierre-Luc Dubois. That will go to the Winnipeg Jets. Pierre-Luc Dubois, 105 out of 199. Pierre-Luc Dubois. Another nice thick card in there. Hopefully that bodes well for us. Next up, we have Joseph Valeno exclusives. That will go to the Detroit Red Wings. Joey Valeno, 134 out of 199. Joe Valeno. Lots of exclusives in this box. Next up, Jake Bean, Program of Excellence. Jake Bean. And I know he was Carolina. Is he still Carolina, Jake Bean? Just taking a look here. No, nope, he is Columbus now. Columbus, Jake Bean, Program of Excellence. Next up, oh, there's a nice one. 
Logo patch, Team Canada, Julian Goche. Julian Goche, logo patch. Julian Goche, I believe that is going to be the New York Rangers, if I'm not mistaken. Let's see, let's see if that will fit into one of these. There we go, that works. Logo patch, nice one there. Julian Goche. Ah, uh, no Vancouver yet. No Vancouver yet. And I think we got a high gloss coming for Marcus Phillips. High gloss, Marcus Phillips. Number five out of 25. Five out of 25. Marcus Phillips, high gloss. Now, Marcus Phillips, let me take a look and see where this guy's at. All right, Marcus Phillips is a Winnipeg Jets prospect. Winnipeg Jets, Marcus Phillips. High gloss. All right, a couple more coming from Team Canada. And there's another nice big thick patch or something coming here. And Mario Lemieux, program of excellence. That will go to Pittsburgh. Mario Lemieux. Philippe Myers, program of excellence. Philippe Myers, I believe that's Nashville. I think Nashville is where Philippe Myers is at now. Correct me if I'm wrong. Again, I will double check that after. Ooh, we got Aaron Ambrose. There's a nice one. That is going to be for Team Canada Women's, so that will be a random to everybody. All teams will be eligible for this. 191 out of 199. Nice hit here. Aaron Ambrose. Nice one there. Aaron Ambrose. Another nice pull. And what we got here, another Marty Brodeur, local legends, local legends, Marty Brodeur going to the devs. And Kale Clegg, Kale Clegg, I believe that is Toronto who's going to get that. Team Canada jerseys, Kale Clegg. Kale Clegg. Size thicker on those. Kale Clegg. All right, there was box number one. Next up, let's see. Let's do series one next. Let's do series one next. Series one hobby. Uh, serial number ending in 37077. All right, come on, let's hit some of the big boys here. Series one. Empty box. Yeah, that was a decent box from Team Canada for sure.
The nice thing about the 2017 Team Canada is you can hit Wayne Gretzky autos. Uh, in some of the newer stuff, I don't think there's the I don't think they have the Wayne Gretzkys. And there's not as much of a focus on some of the older legends. Uh, no, no Vancouver yet in box number one, Troy. No Vancouver yet. All right, here we go. Good luck, everybody. And starting us off, we have for the Minnesota Wild, Kapo Kakinen. Canvas, Kapo Kakinen. Next up, for the Montreal Canadiens, Electromagnetic, Nick Suzuki. We have our first young gun, R2. Or sorry, I was going to say R2 Rustalainen. and this is Matthias Samuelson, Buffalo Sabres. Matthias Samuelson. We got Alexander Barkov, superstar honor roll for Florida. Hundo P, Brent Burns for the Sharks. Our first Dazzlers will go to the Toronto Maple Leafs, Mitch Marner. Mitch Marner, Dazzlers. Uh... Okay, sounds good. Uh, send me a reminder if you can, Rob. Send me a reminder, please. And, uh, this box is shedding here. And then I'll take a look at it after the break. We got Joey Valeno for the Detroit Red Wings. Young Guns, Joe Valeno. Joe Valeno. Next up, Shea Theodore, Electromagnetic for Vegas. For the Ottawa Senators, Philip Gustafson, Young Guns. Philip Gustafson, Young Guns. Philip Gustafson. Next up, Ryan Nugent Hopkins, Canvas for the Oilers. And, ooh, there's a nice hit. For the Edmonton Oilers suit variant for Connor McDavid. I believe that's going to Jesse. Congrats, buddy. Nice pull. Those are tough hits. Connor McDavid suit variant for the Edmonton Oilers. Nice pull there. Connor McDavid. Nice hit for the Edmonton Oilers. And Ovi Portraits, Alex Ovechkin for the Caps. That's the first uh, suit variant that I've pulled with Connor McDavid, so nice little hit. Haven't seen many of them. I've opened lots of cases and we've only pulled maybe two or three since release day of the suits. Yeah. 
unless you're going to pull one, probably the best one you can get. All right. We have next up Brian Rust, Canvas, Pittsburgh. Hundo, Duncan Keith for the Blackhawks. Next up, Wyatt Kalinick, Young Guns, for the Chicago Blackhawks. Wyatt Kalinick for Chicago. Wyatt Kalinick. Next up, Henrik, or sorry, I was going to say Henrik Lundqvist. Uh, Igor Shesterkin, honor roll for the Rangers. Igor Shesterkin. Vitek Vanacek for the Washington Capitals, rookie retrospective. We have a French variant for the LA Kings, Drew Doughty. Drew Doughty, French. Final stack of series one. Next up, Tice Thompson, Young Guns, for the New Jersey Devils. Tice Thompson. Yes, any, any hit counts for a team. Any hit counts. Tice Thompson for the Devils. Next up, Bowen Byram, debut dates for Colorado. And we have Radim Zahorna, Young Guns, for the Pittsburgh Penguins. Radim Zahorna. Yeah, well. Radim Zahorna. Next up, Michael Backlund, canvas for Calgary. And I think we got a clear cut coming. Yes, we do. And it's going to go to the Carolina Hurricanes. Jacob Slavin. Jacob Slavin. Clear cut for Carolina. Jacob Slavin. And a Austin Matthews portraits for Toronto. Austin Matthews portraits. And that's our Series 1 box. Not the greatest box there. No big young guns, unfortunately, coming out of that box. Biggest hit certainly being that Connor McDavid suit variant. All right, we've got a bit of a throwback now. I like this stuff. 11-12, Panini Elite. This is some nice stuff, and there are some big potential hits in these. Panini Elite. Maybe we can pull some monsters here. Box. All right, come on. Let's pull some fire here. Uh, one second, Dustin. Uh, who did you land? You have the Vegas Golden Knights uh, and the Arizona Coyotes, uh, which also gets the Winnipeg Jets vintage. 
So you won you won Vegas as the free giveaway team. All right, here we go. Okay, first up, we have a rookie for the Columbus Blue Jackets, David Savard. David Savard, rookie for the Columbus Blue Jackets. And I think we got a gold. Nice. We have a Wayne Simmons gold die cut for the Flyers. Wayne Simmons gold. Uh, 17 out of 99. 17 out of 99 for Philadelphia. Wayne Simmons. Uh, Team Canada, the cards went to whoever the player is currently with. For retired guys, it went to the team they played the majority of their career with. Uh, Vegas has gotten an insert so far. I know that. And what do we got here? Something for the Dallas Stars. Ooh, Louis Erickson. We have Elite Materials autographed jersey. Louis Erickson for the Dallas Stars. And that number is 20 out of 25. Somebody get a hold of Joe Chung. All right. Somebody get a hold of Joe Chung. This is a card for him. Louis Erickson. Jersey Auto. Twenty out of twenty-five. Very nice pull there. Let's take down that. Next up, we got for the Vancouver Canucks. There you go, Troy. We got a Ryan Kessler, red die cuts. Ryan Kessler, red die cuts for Vancouver. Yeah, for anybody familiar, Joe, Joe Chung, he's a, he's a Canucks guy, but uh, he does not like Louis Erickson, but we randomly send him Louis Erickson cards just to tick him off. So a little kind of... Fun hobby thing going. We got new breed jersey for Columbus. Cam Atkinson. New breed. Cam Atkinson for Columbus. And that's a little thick. Let's try that. Cam Atkinson. And we have four. The Ottawa Senators. Eric Condra, blue rookie. Eric Condra, another die cut. Oh, we got back to back die cuts here. We have for the Detroit Red Wings, Henrik Zetterberg. Henrik Zetterberg die cut. And for the Carolina Hurricanes, a red die cut of Justin Falk. Justin Falk, red die cut rookie. Justin Falk. Nice one there. Next up for the Edmonton Oilers, we have Elite Series, Taylor Hall and Ryan Nugent Hopkins. Elite Series. How far Louis Erickson has fallen. He's considered a, a pretty elite scorer until he came to Vancouver, and then that was the end of that. Next up, we have Matt Reed, Stars, Ricky. Matt Reed for the Flyers. We got a Jordan Stahl red die cut for Pittsburgh. Jordan Stahl. And what do we got coming here? We have for the Detroit Red Wings. There's a nice one. Nick Lidstrom, prime numbers. There's a nice one. Prime numbers. Nick Lidstrom for the Detroit Red Wings. 
numbered 69 out of 253 prime numbers nick lidstrom i like these prime number cards very nice Next up, Dion Phaneuf, red die cut for Toronto. Dion Phaneuf. And an auto coming for the Calgary Flames. Ricky Otto, Roman Horak. Roman Horak. Ricky Otto, not numbered. Roman Horak. Rookie auto for the Calgary Flames. All right, final stack here from Panini. <laughs> well, you never know. You might get lucky, Dustin. You might get lucky in pro set. Because you get the Winnipeg Jets vintage as well, right? So there's always chance that some of the legends from the past with Arizona. unfortunately next up Steven Stamkos Elite Series for Tampa Bay and for the Ottawa Senators Red Die Cut Milan Mahalik Milan Mahalik for the Ottawa Senators Red Die Cut and one last hit coming and it's going to be Stars for the Tampa Bay Lightning Steven Stamkos Steven Stamkos. All right. That is Panini. We move along. Next up is Pro Set. All right. Pro Set Memories Hockey. Good luck, everybody. Let's pull some fire here. So, again, for those who may be new or unfamiliar with how we work these. Uh, boxes because typically pro set does not always have teams specified on the cards. Okay. The Jersey does not matter that the player is wearing. Okay. Um, so, and if there's no NHL logo on it and there is no specific team designation for retired players, it goes to the team they played the majority of their career with. Okay, if it is a current NHL player, it goes to the team that they are currently with. All right. Just because Leaf typically, uh, President's Choice often does not have the license, so they're not allowed to put the teams. All right, starting us off, we have a referee card. Uh, four out of five, buyback. Four out of five, Rob Schick. Rob Schick, four out of five. All right, four out of five. So this is another one for the random. We, this will be a random to everybody, along with that Aaron Ambrose card. Okay, I'll put that aside for now. So everybody will be in the random for that. Next up, we have a Pro Set Memories buyback, five out of five for the Boston Bruins, Dave Christian. Dave Christian, five out of five for the Boston Bruins buyback. Dave Christian. Okay, and this next one here I think is going to be, let me double check this here. I don't think, give me a second here. I don't think that this player ever actually played
Let's take a look. Nope, he never played a single. Oh, baby, it's a huge one, too. I didn't see the numbering on this, but we got a monster pull coming. Woo! Vladislav Trechak, one out of one auto. Boom! One out of one. One out of one. Vladislav Trechak. What a card. One out of one. That is crazy. Vladislav Trechak. That is a beautiful card. My goodness. One out of one. Yeah, he never played a single game in the NHL. Not a single game in the NHL. All right, well, since he did, this is one of those cases he was never, he did not play a single game in the NHL. So I believe this is going to have to be a random to everybody. Because for guys who retired, never played a single game in the NHL. That is a beautiful card. Oh man, what are we, let's take this down. One out of one, Vladislav Trechak. All right, well, this one's clearly, we know who this is going to. Mikey Medano, Pro Set Auto, sit 18 out of 25. 18 out of 25, Mikey Medano, that will go to the Dallas Stars. Dallas Stars. Mikey Medano, number 18 out of 25. 18 out of 25. You know, I'm going to, just in, on this, in the case of this card, I'm just going to go back and check my own rules for that are set in the group rules. Okay? Uh, I just want to double check in case, I, I don't think I ever put anything in there if, uh, in the case of a retired player who never played in the NHL, uh, that it would go to the team it was drafted by. I'll, I'll double check my rules though, just to be hundred percent. Because if that's what I have written in my rules, that's what I got to go by. Okay, so I will confirm on this card um, if that did end up by default going to the Montreal Canadiens. Um, I will have to check my own rules because I don't think we've ever had this situation before, or we've had a legend who. Never played in the NHL, but was drafted by an NHL team. So I will double check that to confirm, okay? Just to, to be, to follow the own rules of the group, okay? All right, so this one here is Game Use Stick Rack, President's Choice, 355 out of 1,000, okay? That is box 355. She could have that. Again, I will double check. I will double check the uh, the rules. I want to make sure I'm following what I have written down. But this may be one of those situations where there's actually no rule in place specifically for the situation. All right. So again, uh, President's Choice will be in the same boat. Okay, same boat as Leaf in regards to re retired players. All right. Okay, let's take a look here. Let's see what we got. I'm just going to see here where we're going to start. All right, let's start here. We have a game used stick, six out of ten. 
which will go to the San Jose Sharks, okay? So they actually listed the team for once. San Jose Sharks, Paul Martin. Paul Martin, game used stick rack for the Sharks, game used stick rack. Paul Martin, what is going on here? Why is that so small in the 180 point? Paul Martin, game used stick rack, number six out of 10. All right, next up, we will go here, and this is numbered 5 out of 10, and that's going to the Toronto Maple Leafs, a Mitch Marner stick. There you go. Mitch Marner, President's Choice Stick Rack for the Toronto Maple Leafs. Let me grab a another box of Zombos. Mitch Marner Stick Rack. There you go. That is numbered five out of 10. There's no doubt about where that one's going. Mitch Marner, five out of 10. And that is from the 2020 Spring Expo. Spring Expo. All right, next up, what do we got? Let's see here. Oh, we got a 9 out of 10 for the Calgary Flames. There's a cool one. Jerome Iginla. There's a nice one. Jerome Iginla for the Calgary Flames. And that's kind of a cool. You got the FWT by Easton. Jerome Iginla. Game used stick. Nice hit there for Calgary. Number 9 out of 10. I think that's going to Lloyd because I think that was a trade. Calgary was in the trade. Nice pull. Jerome Aginla, game used stick rack. Nice hit there for the Calgary Flames. All right. And last but not least, what do we have here? Woo! We got a big one. Let me just see if this says anything on team. We have a game used lumber graphs. Check this out. Sick pull. Glenn Harmon, number one out of one. Glenn Harmon, one out of one lumber graphs. That is a sick hit. Now, let me take a look and see where did Glenn Harmon play? I'm assuming it's for one of the original six teams. All right, let's take a look here. I think this is going to go to... Let's take a look here. Yep, that's going to the Montreal Canadiens. There you go, Sean. That is a hit. A monster pull there. One of one lumber graphs that will go to the Montreal Canadiens. Glenn Harmon. Or sorry, that's not going to, to Sean. Sorry, you've got Toronto. You wanted you wanted uh, the Montreal Canadiens. Dang. Who's got Montreal in this? I think that is. I think that's Rob. Rob Imbo's got them. Wow. What a pull. Montreal Canadiens. One of one, Glenn Harmon. Yeah, sorry, I, I had I know that's that's your team, Sean. You wanted Montreal. Yeah, he played, actually, he played back from 1937 to 1955. So, according to uh, Elite Prospects, he played uh, from 1937 to 1955. What a pull. 
Yeah, he played for uh, Montreal uh, for pretty much his entire career. He had a couple of games. There was what the Brandon Elks, uh, the Montreal uh, Canadians, the Montreal Royals. Wow. What a card. Put that aside. Glenn Harmon. Congrats. All right. I'm going to quickly check in regards to this while we're live. Okay. I'm going to quickly go check again the specifics on the rule in regards to retired players. So just give me a second here. Let me pull up that rule. The rule book here and see if, there, if I have anything in specifics for this case. So just give me a second here. All right, let's take a look. All right, well, okay, we got, here is exactly the wording for this situation. So I think this is going to actually not go to random on that Trek Shack card. You guys can see this. If you go to the featured section, you can uh, check out the specific rules. Rule number C, okay, this is what I've written a long time ago. I had forgotten because this has been, I don't think that we've had this situation before. So. If a player is on a juniors team or other non-NHL team, it will go to the team that they're currently playing for. Doesn't count for this card. If the player is retired, which he is, it will go to the team they played the most games in their career for. He did not play in the NHL. But it says if the player was never drafted nor played in the NHL, it will be random among all teams in that break. Since he was drafted by the Montreal Canadiens, it will, by default, go to the Montreal Canadiens, okay? All right, so what a break for the Montreal Canadiens. That one-of-one Trek Shack is going to go to you. So you're lucky that he was drafted there, Rob. If he would not have been drafted, that, uh, unfortunately, would have gone to the randomizer. But that is going to go to the Montreal Canadiens since he was drafted by them, which I did not actually know until you guys let me know about that. I was not aware that he, <coughs> that he was drafted. Okay, we do have two cards, however, which will go to the randomizer for everybody. We have the Aaron Ambrose uh, patch auto. Okay, that was 191 out of 199 from Team Canada. Team Canada Women's, so that will be uh, randomized. And then we have the Rob Schick uh, buybacks, four out of five. Okay, four out of five referee card, which is, again, non-team specific. So those will both go into a randomizer. So as soon as I'm, I'm off here on the live feed, I will set up a random uh, amongst all the teams, and then I will post that in the group break thread. Okay, so on that post, I will add this to it and we'll run the randomizer. Top two teams on the final random will get this card. This will go to spot one. Rob Schick will go to spot number two. Okay. All right. I hope that uh, makes sense for everybody. Again, appreciate everybody who jumped into this break. And my, apologize, my apologies if uh, I wasn't as excited and such for some of the bigger hits today as I normally would have been. I am still, still feeling under the weather. But hopefully within the next couple of days, I'll be back to my A game and we will have some more fire that we can pull for you guys. So next group break, uh, I will not set a date. I will see how I'm feeling in order to determine that. OK, if I'm feeling much better tomorrow, we'll get another break up. So, again, I appreciate everybody. Thanks for your patience with this one. Uh, I know it was sold out for a couple of days uh, and I'm glad we were able to do it tonight. So, again, thanks, everybody. Have a great rest of your night. Mike here, Flying V, Cards and Breaks.